Wow, do you see that it bounces twice as high? JoJo Science Show! Hello, welcome to JoJo Science Show! Today we're going to see what happens when I leave a basketball and a balloon in the sun. <laughs> this experiment teaches us about air pressures and temperatures. All you'll need for this experiment is a soft basketball, a balloon, and a measuring tape. So let's go outside. When I drop the basketball early in the morning, it only bounces a little. Let's see what happens if I drop it early in the afternoon after leaving it out in the sun all day. Wow, do you see that it bounces twice as high? Let's compare this side by side. On the left, it's cooler in the morning. On the right, it's the afternoon when it's warmer. See how the basketball bounces higher in the afternoon? Why is that? If we can see inside a basketball, then we can see what's happening to the air particles. But first, let us define pressure. Pressure is when a force is applied to an area. In the case of a basketball, the pressure is because all the air particles hit the wall area with force. When the basketball is cool, the air particles move very slowly and lazily. When the sun shines on it, the air particles start to get hot and move really crazy. When they get hot, they like to move it, move it. This is called thermal excitation. As the air particles move faster, they hit the inside walls of the basketball with more force. That increases the pressure of the ball and bounces higher. We also put a balloon in the freezer and in the sun and measured how big it is. After taking it out of the freezer, the balloon was 24 inches. After putting it in the sun, the balloon grew over an inch. See how it's over 25 inches now? When the air particles get hot, they push against the walls of the balloon with greater force, and the balloon grows. <laughs> the balloon grows because the same air particles take up more space. You just learned why air pressure increases with temperature. If you like this video, then hit the thumbs up button down below, and subscribe to my channel so you can see all my fun videos. And if you want to tell me something, then leave a comment. And remember, kids, science is fun.